How's it going? This is Tim here. Um, we're on part number 17. It's on page 80 of the manual. And um, so this this one, this looks a little bit trickier than the last one. Um, we have how many views? One, two, three, four, five, six. And one view looks like it's has all the most of the dimensions on it. So that's that's the view you I want to start with, or you should start with. I think the first feature we're going to do is we're going to do a revolve of this semi-looking football gizmo, and we're going to imagine that there's no tubes coming out of it or a flange. We're going to add those later. We're going to worry about this flange. This this shape is what we want. And it looks like it has um, a, a diameter of 76. So we'll write that down. Um, this is definitely going to be our origin. Now, what's the wall thickness? This is 64. I see that's 64. 76, 64. And then we have 3.5 and 1.5. So that's 5 up. That's too much to remember. Let's get the two circles going. So we'll go get this on millimeters. We'll create a sketch on the front plane, and I'm just going to get the two circles one, two. I'm going to get myself a, a midpoint line like that, and I'm going to make this for construction. Now, this lad is 76. And this is 64. Um, 76 and 64. And then it looks like we're going to have a line coming off of this. And it comes down. And then it comes over. Oh, my brain. Something like that would it be. Um... Ah, damn it, anyway. Um, this comes... No, I don't think that's right. I feel like it comes up something like this. And then up. And then over. And let's get ourselves a centre line going in this direction. Um, okay. Now, if I trim that there... And I trim this, and I trim that, and I trim this, and I trim that, and I trim this. I get that. And I'm going to get myself a line going from there to there. Now, um, let's go back. Not to Spotify, but um, this, uh, this is diameter 100. Okay. So from there to there is 100. And I remember this being, I think this is 3.5. Let's try that again, 3.5. And I think this is 1.5, isn't it? Speaking of Spotify, it's, I think it's awesome. I actually started paying for it. And it's just, it's introduced me to so much music. Um, but people say, look, Pandora is just as good. I, I don't even know. Um, now, what diameter is this? This is 70 and then 64. So I feel like this is going to be from there to there is 70. Let's try that again. 70, okay? Um, and that's my that's my first sketch. Um, I think so. I'll rev I'm going to revolve this 360 degrees. We only have to draw half of it whenever you're doing a revolve. So we go to features, revolve. Axis of revolution is going to be this chap, and it picked up the contour like right away. So now we have this space looking saucer thingy. I'm going to draw a sketch on here, and let's get the, the construction circle going. 
Now, what size is the construction circle? It's radius 44, 88. 88, okay. Um, 88. Okay, um, I'm going to use the whole wizard here. I'm going to click the face. I'm going to go to whole wizard to get those counter bores in, I think, unless it's going to be a pain. And it's, let me write this down, it's 6 through and it's 9 counter bore going down 1.5 millimeters. Um, I think we're going to have to have some sort of custom counter bore. So show custom sizing, 9. Um, maybe maybe this is um, uh, an M M6 or an M5. Uh, no. Um, anyway, I'm going to make this 6 millimeters. I'm going to make this I don't know this might you might look this it's probably bad form right here and um, what I'm doing but I don't care at this stage 1.5 probably when the drawing gets produced you'd want to be careful because it would say this is a size for an M5 when it's just a custom sizing um is it M6 no um what do we do in this situation uh, it's it's none of them um, look, I'm just gonna I'm gonna go back. I'm just gonna do it with a sketch. So we want this to be six. We want this to be nine. And that's what we're left with. How many do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'll be honest with you. This, um, you know, this quarantine and it's tough. You know, I'm getting, t I'm getting antsy. You know, I want to get out, but um, nothing I can do really. It's getting old, but a bit grumpy today, as you can probably tell. Now, um, that's the hole going all the way through, and then this comes down 1.5. Like, and I'm a homebody. You know, and it's uh, you know, uh, God help the people who are, who really like to get out. Um, anyway, circular pattern. You don't watch these videos to so listen to my problems. Um, circular pattern. Um, we want to do these two features, and we make this six, and we go okay. So now we have that. And um, we got the flange with the six holes, the six counter bores. Right. Um, what's next? Let's maybe, let's guess this um, little hole here. Um, let me think here for a second. Um, that's 45 from that face. So if I go... If I look at this view here, no, if I look at that front view, that might work. And if I create a sketch on that front view, there you go. And I draw a line that's up 45 and how far 43 and 45. Um, my wife is also, she's making me, she's making me eat salads. Um, she doesn't get too fat. I mean, eat too much junk during this pandemic bullshit. So uh, I had a salad. To, it just didn't satisfy me, to be honest. Forty-three. Um, usually like having lots of ramen, but anyway, I'll be I'll be all right. Now we have this point here. I'm going to exit out of this. Um create a plane I click the line and then the point and I go okay and that's look at my plane nice my nice work plane there but I use the sketch to make the work plane um a student actually showed me that about 10 years ago so anyway um I'm going to draw two circles on that now what size are they 
25 and 16. Twenty five and sixteen. And sixteen. Okay. So um I'm going to um extrude, flip this around, up to next. I'm also going I feel like I'm gonna do this this one also and that and I'm gonna go okay. And then is that behaving? Yeah, and then I'm gonna extrude, cut this all the way through using the selected contours, and we go up to next. And then we have a porthole there. Um, no, this one is twenty, and that one is thirty, so they're a different size. And then I wonder if I, I wish I could mirror this over and then break it reference um this is 60 degrees i can't mirror it over um okay don't worry about it uh i'm going to create a sketch on the front plane and we'll just get a center line boop and how far does it need to come it needs to come up 53 this is 60 degrees uh, let's slow down here for a sec. 53 is the length of that line. 53. All right. Um, I exit out of this. I go to reference geometry. One. I click the line and I click the point. Now, let's write down these numbers here. Um, 20 and 30. 30 is the big one and 20 is the small one. Piece of cake. I click a sketch on this plane. I get my two circles. This is 30 and that's going to be 20. No, um, I have. They're not behaving, so I need to find out why are they are. Will they not lock into the? There you go. Right, is that right? Twenty and thirty. And then the twenty and the thirty. Uh, yeah. So let's just extrude both of them up to flip it around up to surface there you go and we have that let's um now if i click on this and i go normal two and i create a sketch on that and i get myself a center rectangle um what are the old fillet sizes the fillet sizes are radius eight One, two, three, four. Is this thing a rectangle or a square? It looks like it's. Um, you can assume that it's a square, and of course, I didn't give you the dimensions. Uh, 34. What a pain. Oh, God. Excuse me for a sec. Uh, I'll get the old calculator out. I'm too tired. Uh, 34 plus 8 plus 8 is 50. Right, so I, here's 34. Where did I get the 50 from? The distance from here to here is a radius 8. That means the distance from there to there is 8. That means the distance from that line to that line is 34 plus 8 plus 8. Um, so you should, that should be put in 50 to make life easy. Um, 50 and 50 and it goes black all right what's its thickness its thickness is five I click on the sketch I'll flip this around 
and I'll go 5. And now we have that uh, flange. I'm going to go back to this sketch and we're going to cut that hole through. Through all. Okay. Now what's next? We need um, the same circles. Diameter 6, diameter 9. Um, now if I if I highlight this sketch, which one is it? It's that one there. Uh, and I'll edit it. And I'll just highlight it. And press Control C. Exit. And I'm going to go New Sketch. Look at that. Um, and I'm just going to make these, this, and this concentric. Um, and I need to put these dimensions in. 9, uh, 6, um, I'm going to have to do this three more times. I'll make all these circles the same size. Make them all equal. I'm holding down the control key. One, two, three, four, equal. Now, um, I click on the sketch, extrude a cut. One, two, th oh, three, for uh, up to next all right and then we go back to the sketch um what do we want we want these to be 1.5 depth and now we have our four counter bores so i'm just going to turn off these planes because we don't want to delete them um ah, not too difficult you know um that's our boy there, right there now. Um, is there anything else we're missing? Piece of cake. What's the next one like? Hopefully a bit more challenging. Um, that's it. That's part number 17. Might have a cup of tea and we might look at part number 18 next. Alright, take care guys. I hope you're staying sane. Bye.